uploading course content to upload your course content you click on course setup content then module so course setup content then the module where you want to create the respective course let's say you want to upload your course content here so you put in the title there eh? so online the title here is online teaching strategies so after you created that you can see here the word they come out edit page just click on edit page edit page okay so now you have a title here as usual you will change this with an image that's already available Okay, now for it here, you're going to type in something the notes about online teaching strategies. Okay, here's an example. Next, you want to add a video. Okay, you want to add a video. This is the link of the video. Okay, to add the video, you click on the video widget so right now we're going to pull it, this thing down so that you have some space for the widget okay so we're going to pull down here put it here okay here is the widget so we're going to put the title here best online teaching strategies we we'll put the URL there okay. you can come up with uh, a and I, you can come up with a thumbnail if you have a thumbnail available okay let's just put in a simple thumbnail Okay, so once you're done here, you just click finish editing. Okay, so we already have the text part, the video. Now we're going to put in the file. File could be anything, could be a Word file, could be a document file, could be a PDF file. So we're going to have the this thing here. Okay. So we're going to put in a file here, we're going to put a PowerPoint. Okay. So we're going to drag and drop the files here. Okay. So this one is just sample. Open. So the file is being uploaded now. So we already have all this. We have the files, we have the video, and we have the text. So inside one content page, you can have all of this. You can have the notes in terms of text. You can have the notes in terms of video. You can have the, you can share whatever files that you have your students here. So right now it is very difficult to see everything in one view. Let's make it easier for the students by changing the layout. So click on layout. So we can change the the width to become only half. Okay, shrink to half width. Here again we're going to mouse over at the bottom right, half width. Okay, the video also half width. Okay, so we're going, to, we're going to drag and drop. So we're going to drag and drop the video to the top. 
and we need to drag the file here. Okay. Once we put the layout, everything is arranged like this. Okay. So we can click save and close. So now when you click to view the page, it looks like this. Where right, the text files on the left side, the video is here and the PowerPoint is here. And the PowerPoint the student can download. If you don't feel like allowing the student to download, you can at least uh, block it under the setting. So here for the video, you want to watch the video, you click the play button, then you expand the size. Welcome to our session today, Best Practices in Online Teaching. We're so glad that you have joined us today. Okay, and with that, thank you very much.